Guys, this is Xenomics. Welcome to today's video. As you can see, Ezio Short requested to know more about doing lands. So I'm going to show you how I do lands at my house, and simply I'm going to show you the principle that you can do at your house or at your mate's house or anywhere. So as you can see in front of you, there's a Netgear router. Now I know that many people are familiar with this because most internet service providers send you this. This is the kind of almost like the default model which is sent to many houses. It has four Ethernet ports at the back of it. So as you can see I've got two connected, one for this computer and the other one for my computer. And the basic point is you can bring up other computers and simply connect them with an Ethernet cable to the Netgear router and you would have created a four computer local area network. Now, if you're going to bring, I don't know, 10 people in, how would you be able to connect them to the network? Now, I'm sure you know that you can connect wirelessly, but wireless is not so much reliable, especially when you're playing, you know, games when you want instant and spontaneous reactions, you know, if it's a first-person shooter or something like that. Well, what I would do, and what I do, is use a switch. Now, if you've seen my videos already, you've seen that I've got a full review about the Edimac switch, it's an 8 port fast ethernet switch. Now there's something called a switch and there's something called a hub. The switch is an intelligent hub. So I recommend you get your hands on a switch. Your switches are usually more expensive because they do a better job, they will give you a better connection, they'll give you a better ping, a better latency to the server, and you won't lose that much speed from the internet or the network. So I recommend you get your hands on a switch. You should be able to find some on the internet, though they come very cheap, as long as you search well. So let me just show you this ethernet switch that I use. It simply has eight ports behind it, and you simply connect it to the power, 12 volts, and off you go. Everybody brings their computers, everyone brings ethernet cables, and they simply plug it in to these ports. And that's it. Now all the computers can connect to the network, they can go on an internet server, the same internet server, and connect spontaneously. This is the method that I do LAN parties in. Maybe some other people have different ways of doing this. But is your shot? This is my way for setting up LAN parties. I hope the video was helpful. If it helped you, then I'm sure it helped many more others. Make sure to show that by subscribing, rating, and commenting on the video. Hopefully, I'll see you later in another video.